Hey what guys it's Fish here and welcome back to some more Mountain by the Clash of Kings. Um, we last left off we actually captured Brenly Baratheon which was pretty crazy. Um, we actually managed to um, yeah, defeat him in battle, not just by ourselves obviously. Um, we did actually have to uh, use the support of one of Stannis' men, I can't actually remember his name. Um, but we did go ahead and level up ourselves um, as well as that. I did actually just level up one of our Reach Knights and they look fucking cool, look how cool they look. It's kind of a shame I can't go get any more because we are actually technically at war with uh, the Reach right now, so that's kind of annoying. However, a load of our other men did also upgrade, uh, so let's go ahead and see, uh, we got, um, oh we should probably go ahead and bring this dude up. Does he have a horse? Because I, I noticed that we don't actually have a horse. Um, by the looks of it, he probably would have had his own horse anyway, because he is a sir. But still, I might have to go steal his horse. So let's go ahead and uh, just upgrade quite a few of these troops. These troops look fucking cool. What, do I, what does upgrading them make them look like? They're just more heavily armoured. Oh, they look really cool. Two-handed. They just look like they've got a big-ass weapon. Um, I kind of need to save my money then. I mean, he can get upgraded. They can get upgraded because it's not really that much. Um, and it does give them probably quite a bit more armor. However, I can't really afford to upgrade many of the other guys just because that's so much. Yeah, like 96. I, I really can't afford that um, whatsoever because I am already going to be in debt unless I get some more money ASAP. So hopefully we can sell Renly and then we don't have to worry about um, worry about that. So what we'll do is I kind of want to boost up my leadership, which is, which is a charisma skill, is it not? Um, leadership increases your party morale. Um, not enough charisma. So let's go ahead and boost charisma. We still don't have enough uh, charisma to level up, but it's still in the right direction, so that's fine. We have power draw, which is nice. Uh, what else? Tracking tactics is always good. Pathfinding we can't boost up. That's agility. No, that's intelligence. Uh, in management's fine. I might go inventory management because it's plus six uh, capacity, which is actually really good. Or surgery, actually yes, surgery. From playing uh, Viking Conquest, I've actually come to come to like that a lot more. That skill. Um, okay, cool. So we actually haven't got that many men now. So what we really need to do is we need to go to a castle. Uh, we'll go to Duskendale first, just to see. Um... Oh no, we were going over here, weren't we, to go ahead and raid Fool's Mine or Fool's Mere before anyone else did. So we're going to quickly, hopefully, rush over there. We have to be very careful. We're not at war with uh, Rob Stark, are we? I'm pretty sure we're not at war with Rob Stark. I'm pretty sure we're just at war with Renly, and even though we might be. Um, okay, cool. I might go check Dale quickly just to see if there's a Lord in Dale. Hopefully there isn't, so we can just hopefully raid Fool's Mirror and get a ton of money. Uh, or Derry, even. I was calling it Dale. Uh, there is. There's two Lords in there. But both their parties are pretty wounded. I might just go for it. Because if one of them attacks me, I can probably fight him off. Them raiders have... Them raiders have so many prisoners. Elite swords. Just like so many... So many men. 58 prisoners. And that is a lot of money. So let's go and loot and burn the village. Um, some of the angry villagers grab their tools to try and stop me. Charge them. What do they think they're doing? Oh my god, I'm really weak. Holy crap. We have to be careful. Um, I don't want my cavalry to run off and die. Uh, my infantry can just go ahead and hold here. And my archers can just go ahead and hold a little bit behind them. Infantry, hopefully I can get them to form formation quickly. Um, stand closer. What one is it for? Oh my god, look how cool they look. So my infantry is just going to get a little bit closer. Ready to receive the, the enemy. Who's that running off into them? What a lad. Cool, they should die pretty quickly. Oh, my longbowmen just... Oh my god, look at that two-handed sword just go to town. What are my archers doing? Everyone has to charge, I think. Oh no, everyone fucking charge. Um, I need to get my sword out. Sorry, I was trying to command there. I mean, we should just slaughter these guys. They, they really shouldn't cause me any hassle whatsoever. Especially my knights. They just shouldn't be able to get through my armor, really. 
They're just absolutely swarming that knight up there. Holy crap. We need to go ahead and help him. Look at them all. Uh, what did I get hit by? Oh, an arrow. Okay, cool. Oh, I mean, I'm way too low, so I literally just have to let my men do this. And just be careful of that one archer who hit me. Where did she even hit me? I mean, we can probably kill these guys. Just make sure I don't get hit. Did I just kill, like, two people there? Oh my god, them two-handed swordsmen are so cool. And that's my reach knight as well, so I definitely wanted to try and save him. Is everyone killed? Okay, cool, yeah. So I don't know what them peasants were doing. Oh, what did we lose? We lost one mounted breach sergeant. Oh, he's only wounded, actually. That's fine. And we lost one. Okay, cool. And we gave him a renowned and... Um, yeah, renowned, which was good. The lord of the castle hates me a little bit more. Um, after consulting with the peers of the realm, King Stannis has declared that Kingsport on you? Oh yes, so I've got my own castle now. But it will probably mean that you will not receive other awards for a little while. Except the honour, where is Kingsport? I don't even know where it is. Um, I mean, right now we have to make sure we don't get... We don't get attacked by the Lords of Derry. But then we'll go ahead and have a look. That's awesome, we actually have our own castle now. Um, people are going to be a little bit pissed at us, but we need this money desperately. Like, one of our followers is going to be pissed. But I don't really care. I mean, that's enough food to last us for, our, for a long time. Um, where even is it? So, it'll be somewhere over here, surely. King spot over here. It's been looted, but he's gone ahead and given it to me. Has he just given me that? I mean, I'm happy just with that. I would have liked the castle, but, you know, just having that town's fine. It's going to get raided pretty much 24-7. However, that's fine. So, cool. Let's let's make our way over to Duskendale over here. We can go ahead and sell all the stuff we just looted, as well as try and ransom Stannis. I mean, try and ransom Renly, even. Because he's going to be worth a lot of money. Like, I'm, I'm probably, like, hoping, like, 6 to 10 grand, hopefully. And then that should set us up for a long while. We can probably get ourselves a better sword. And, you know, it's all going to go good. So let's go ahead and look for a slave trader first. Um, hello. Uh, bard, townsman, some peasant woman. Oh, she's willing to ask us to go defend a town. Oh, he wants to fight me. Okay. I mean, we're not really equipped. Well, our health is pretty low right now. But he's not going to really stand a chance, is he? Um, uh, yeah, I killed him. I gained an arming sword. That's actually a pretty nice sword. Uh, such a waste. Better him than me. Better him than me, of course. I would not like to die. Any slave traders up here? Slave traders? Um, no, but it looks like we might have to go to Dragonstone to find a slave trader. Cool, let's go ahead and sell all this stuff then. Um, yeah, sell all this. So we're already receiving a sh like two grand from all this. Let's just get rid of it all. Okay, cool. Um, oh yeah, and this. This velvet's worth so much money. Can we now upgrade it? What do we currently have? We just currently have an arm. Okay, sorry about that. My game, my, I don't know why, but my mountain blade just constantly minimizes itself. It's kind of a bit a bit weird. Um, so what do we have? We currently have an arming sword. I could get a balanced arming sword. How much better is that? Does about three more damage. Short sword. My sword's still better than that short sword. Um, I might just keep the money for now because I need to go ahead and I need to go ahead. I might sell this balanced spear and just get like a normal, a better spear. Because this spear looks a lot longer. Or maybe even a hook just so I can start like hitting them over over my shield wall. Because my shield is currently a lot better than all of these, is it not? Um, so what's it? Resistance 6. Resistance zero on that one. Um, yeah, so my shield's currently pretty good. And I, I, I need want to have the money, really. Like, I don't really need anything else. Maybe there's some, some better armor. But I don't want, obviously I don't want all my money. I mean, that armor looks pretty fucking cool. What even, how good even, it's not even that, yeah, it's, the chest armor is the same, and the leg armor is a little bit better. Granted, it does look a lot cooler than my current armor. But yeah, well, there's no there's no point getting that. 
Um, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and keep our money then. And then what do we want to do? We want to go ahead and go to um, Dragonstone. Yeah, and as you can see, I've actually turned on dynamic lighting as well. Because for whatever reason, whenever I rendered the video, it would just literally be so dark at night time. So um, I went ahead and turned on dynamic lighting. And hopefully that, that makes it look a lot more brighter. I mean, to me, it makes it look a lot brighter. Like it's kind of just like a summer's eve. Which is good, because obviously you can see what I'm doing. So let's make our way to Dragonstone. Hopefully there's lots and lots of um, slave traders here. Why doesn't Dragonstone like me at all? Oh, Ransom Broker, cool. Um, I want to sell for free prisoners, but he won't take Renly. I assume he didn't take Renly there. That would be really stupid if he did take him. Yeah, I still have Renly Baratheon, cool. Uh, let's, so let's go back to him, visit the tavern again. Uh, <clears throat> greetings, I have any, do you have any prisoners? I wish to ransom one of my companies. Uh, who do you, never mind, okay, maybe not. Well, I guess that's if one of your people get captured. So how do I ransom Renly? That's kind of confused me a little bit. Uh, Dragonstone levies, yes. I will hire how many of you? Four, I guess. Cool, I'll have you. Don't really want them. Uh, you're still being annoying. I really wish you could do the quests. Like, once you say no to a quest, that's it. You can't do it anymore. Um, there's probably no point looking up here. Um, is Stannis here? No, it's just Melisandre and Stannis' wife. So Stannis is obviously out campaigning, which is fine. Um, hello, friend. Who are you? Praise the Lord. Okay, the Lord of Light, of course. Uh, what's our health looking like? Um, we're only still only 25%, so I might rest uh, for a while. But that does mean we can also go ahead and upgrade our men. Uh, yeah, we can upgrade all of these guys. So an elite pikeman or some Riverland archers. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and see how many archers we have. Um, so we just got loads of swordsmen, pikemen. So we have one archer there, two archers there. By the looks of it, that's all we have. I would actually very much... I would very much like to have some more archers. So I think I might upgrade them into archers. Yeah. Okay, cool. And also, I want to go ahead and move all my archers down to the bottom, just so I can see them a bit better. So this way, now I have four archers. I mean, it's not really a lot, but hopefully soon it will start to add up. Um, I, can't, I don't really want to pay for that. That's, the upgrade isn't really worth it. In my opinion, let's talk to Renly. Maybe that's how we ransom him. No, I swear on his fucking big ass. Okay, cool. So, um, tell me in the comments if I don't figure it out in this episode, how do I ransom him? I also need to go buy myself a fucking horse, don't I? Actually, I mean, we're fine on foot right now. I mean, it might not go. Ah, uh, actually, I want to see if, um, if they have anyone who wants to try and join me. No. Apparently there's no recruit button here. That's fine. I probably just literally did it. Um, so let's go to Dragon's or a place by Dragonstone and um, try and recruit some men over here. Is that Stannis right there? That is Stannis right there. Cool. So we'll recruit some men from here um, just to go ahead and bolster our numbers a little bit and then see what Stannis is saying. Oh, just knocked my pop stand over. I want to give up my first. You enforced. Uh, you entrusted me. Um, actually, I would have loved Duskendale, mate. Why didn't you give me it? Oh, he does. He doesn't want to. Um, do you have any tasks for me? Oh, he doesn't want to give me tasks because because I am too much of a lord. I want you to release me from my oath. No, uh, may I say just a course of action? I want to ask you something. Is there? I wish to be affiliated to your family, so I can marry into his family. Oh, cool! You can actually exchange. You can actually exchange um, first, which is kind of cool. Okay, cool. So I'm still kind of somewhat confused about about um, selling Renly, but that's fine. I mean, we could go ahead and take... I could try and probably convince Stannis to mount up and try and take some more land. Um, I mean, eventually taking King's Landing is the goal. 
But until then, that's fine. I mean, all our all our places actually look fairly unlooted as well. So I think the the Lannisters are actually suffering a bit because like literally none of these places are looted whatsoever. So maybe or all over here they're they're looted, but everywhere else they're not they're barely even touched. Oh, it's being raided at the moment. Yeah, so a lot of their places are just getting absolutely wrecked. So I guess let's move out and look for a battle, really. I mean, we've got we've got pretty much almost max. We can hold a total of 61 men. Um, yeah, which is which is good. We got my four four heroes. Oh, we need to rest. Let's go to Dusk and Dale and rest for some time. And we can actually go to uh, Marsh Mark as well on the way. No, we can't. I was going to try and get some more, some more men over there. That's fine. Um, yeah, let's go ahead. Oh, recruit volunteers. Four Dragonstone sergeants. Yes, uh, please. So that's going ahead and increase. Yeah, my my cavalry just by a little bit more. Yeah. So I have now seven horsemen. That's lovely. Cool. Um, now all we really need to do is just. In Keep on increasing my cavalry force, but as well as that, um, make sure that we increase our archery force. Because at the moment we only have like five archers, which isn't really that great. Like, they'll die fairly quickly. Well, they won't really do much damage, is what I'm saying. We better just have it infantry. With this dynamic lighting, the only annoying thing is that half the buildings look somewhat like Storm's End men, like uh, Renly's men. Oh, I think I remember how I sell Randy now. I think you just get an offer, like you just have to have him for so long and then he gets an offer. I, I think that's how it works. Um, we're almost back up to full health. Everyone else is though. And we also have some more men to upgrade for our training. Some more archers. Uh, do we want Dragonstone archers? Uh, pretty much all these levies need to go up, which is nice. Where even are archers? Our archers are all the way down here. I do actually have some Stormland archers. And some Riverland. So let's go ahead and get some more, more archers, I think. So there's only one more. But then that boosts our total up quite a lot. Um, and we literally just have enough for all the weekly costs. So we do need to go out and try and fight someone. Try and get some money. Because our weekly cost is actually going up by quite a bit. Um, I don't know really where to really where to push because Lannisters are fair. I might go over actually over here and start raiding yeah that seems like a good idea I mean we can probably walk this way without really suffering um, it's not letting me click anywhere it's not letting me move there we go that's a little bit better um, yeah there's our weekly budget guys we have another week to get a lot of money that's fine hopefully um, Hopefully we can go ahead and raid some of I mean we can even start raiding some of the reach, but I feel like they're gonna be way too strong for us. We still have nine days left of food, which is good. Um Yeah, so I might move over here. Oh, this is actually really risky. Going this way. Like really risky. That's fine though. I'm gonna risk it. I mean I can always fight some of these bandits as well over in these woods. I just need to keep a real like good eye out. Um, this season pass, days come, um, donate 500 coins, spend an hour in prayer, spend an hour in prayer. Cool, um, but my army's been spotted by, okay, King's Landing's been besieged, change of plan. Let's go back to King's Landing then, or was that the dude? Is Stannis about to take? I think Stannis is about to take King's Landing, which will be pretty cool. And we're nice and healthy as well. We have a lot of men to con well, we have a lot of men to contribute, but we have forty-five, almost fifty men to contribute. He's given Dusk and Dale to someone else. That's fine. I mean, if he doesn't take King's Landing for himself, that this would be hilarious. Um, it's currently under siege. I mean, who are you? I want to chase you. I want to capture you. Come at me, sir. Cool. I want to fight this dude. Mark it down. You shall be hearing it a lot. Um, surrender or die. 
Cool, let's fight him. Um, so he, he'll probably have 20 heavy knights. So let's go ahead and plan my battle because I need to have a nice formation. Even though it's dark, it's night time as well, which I do apologise for. It might be a bit too dark. So I want infantry to hold um, formation and get ranks. I want my archers, um, I want my archers to fall back 10 paces um, and then just start shooting. My cavalry, the cavalry can just follow me straight away. Yeah, cool. That's, that's a good, uh, good plan. Dispatch orders, enough planning to battle. Hopefully we don't get a crappy... Yeah, this isn't actually that bad. Cool. So hopefully we'll form up. They'll have... They'll literally just have knights. I think. Um, my horses can just go ahead and just... Sit over here. That's cool with me. Well, by the looks of it, they only have one knight. Why are they advancing? I swear I didn't tell them to advance ten paces. I need to tell my archers to come up a little bit more. Yeah, he got hit down, like, pretty much straight away. Is that the Lord we're currently fighting? I hope so. Get him down, boys. I want to stab. I want to stab him. Cool, so we took him down. Nice, my archers have formed up a little bit nicer. So we've already taken him down. My archers should hopefully be shooting somewhat soon. Let's go ahead and move my archers just to the side. Oh, no, I don't want my archers to follow me. Ah, uh, archers, hold position. Cool. And we'll get ready to get ready to receive their charge. I'll fill in this gap. Don't know why my men are shifting over at all. We're getting attacked from over here, boys. Yeah, my weapon really is not very good right now. And what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna tell my cavalry to charge right now. So hopefully my cavalry will come in. And aid me here. Yes, Cav, get in there, boys. This dude's mine. Yes, I got him. Lovely. Okay, infantry can charge now as well. Let's overwhelm them with numbers, boys. We literally do have so many men right now. So I overwhelm them. There's Cleave right there. And then my cab will go chase down the rest of their archers. I think you do have quite a few horsemen left as well. Or at least a few horsemen. And there's, uh, yeah, some more of my horsemen. Nice. Uh, I just need to be a little bit careful. I need to try and dismount a few of these knights with my spear. So let's try, let's, yeah, let's try and dismount a few. This probably isn't the best swing. There we go, that's the swing we want. Kite, we've already dismounted him. Sword out, let's fight him. My Reach Knight has been dismounted, but that's fine. Nice, lovely hit, headshot. Yeah, this dude's surrounded. Cool, we managed to get him down. They can't have many knights left now. They're not, they're not, they're, yeah, they must be pretty much out. There's a few of them running around. And now we just swarm them. Cool. So hopefully if we capture this guy as well, we'll be able to ransom him for quite a while, quite a lot. You can see my men up there. And this should give me some good experience. And hopefully some good loot. I'm hoping for some good loot. So they've, yeah, but it looks like they have like two knights over there. And that's probably one of their leaders. That is probably the Sir we're currently fighting. Uh, yeah, we've dismounted all of them now. Lovely boys. Let's go ahead and put the pressure on. Because I don't think I saw any of my knights actually get down. But I think... Quite a few of my men actually like survived that. So I saw quite a few of my men get dishorsed, but um, some veteran two hands. I'm kind of annoyed they died. Men at arms struggling some levies. Yeah, cool. We didn't lose any horses, and we gained morale and renowned. Oh, that's annoying. He managed to escape. Oh well, we can capture him. That's perfect. Upgrade him. Um, yeah, our weekly cost is really really going to start hurting us. We got some good armor though. This should help us out a little bit. Um, cool. I mean, that armor is better than me, but I can't be wearing scummy Lannister gear. Cool, so we got a bit of money and here, oh, Pike actually leveled up. So I might just go ahead and stay at the, the Siege of King's Landing, just in case I do, because obviously I want to be involved. Because I do have a hell of a lot of men here, but King's Landing has 800 men. Um, I don't think I'm even gonna uh, even gonna bother. I mean, actually, no. Stannis is here with a, a good host, but he's literally just gonna get slaughtered. 
I don't think he has enough. I don't think he even outnumbers the garrison. No, he doesn't. I'm just gonna leave, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave. There's no, there's no point. As much as I want to be involved, he, I really, ha if I get involved, I doubt he's gonna be able to fight win that. Just because, like, he might be able to do it if his AI controlled. Just because, oh crap! Just because the AI is like just a bit stupid now and again. Um, but like, still, yeah, I, I don't think if I get involved, the battle will turn out differently. As much as I'd like to. I'm just hiding from that army now, which was chasing us. Um, we can actually probably kill some of these trade caravans if we see any like Lannister ones. And that army's still patrolling out there, it's kind of scaring me a little bit. Let's try and slip past it, nice we have. Um, I also want to go ahead and upgrade my Dragonstone levies just a little bit. Get some more archers, yeah. Hopefully we'll have a lovely uh, archer force now. Well, how many do we have now? We have ten. Ten's enough, I think. Cool. That's nice. And let's go ahead and upgrade Pike. Um, let me have a look at your skills. I don't think your leadership makes a difference to mine. So let's go ahead and just increase your intelligence. Let's go ahead and increase. What should I increase? He doesn't have a shield right now. Forging, I think, definitely does help me. And pathfinding could help me. I'm not sure if it does or not. Let's go and just boost up his one-handed. Even though he does have a pull arm. So that's probably a bit stupid of me. That's fine. Cool. Um, let's go ahead and just recruit a few more men. I know money is an issue right now. However, you know, who cares? More men. I mean, these men don't really cost me anything a month or a week. For Westerland men. Oh, that was a mistake. Let's go ahead and get rid of them. Uh, disband. Yeah, cool. Disband all of them. Just because it gives me a bad morale boost to the rest of my men. So let's go back to Duskendale, sell our equipment, and then kind of figure out how much money we need. Um, yeah, how much money we'll need to get to pay the rest of our, our rent, or <laughs> I guess our rent, our troop costs. So we need about we need about double this to pay. As much as I'd like to recruit some more men, I can't. So I'm going to go this way around and hopefully try and take some of this stuff. Oh, my Kingsport is, is back and nice and healthy. That's nice. Let's go visit our village quickly. Um, as we do take the trip all the way over there. Because unfortunately we aren't strong enough right now to like take cities ourselves. We just don't have enough men. Even though our men are, are starting to get pretty good. We just don't have enough men. Uh, let's go ahead and recruit. Nice. And let's go ahead and manage. Build a manor. Build a mill. Build a watchtower. Build a school. Build a messenger post. These are all way too expensive for me right now. I'm just seeing what they all do. They do take a long time, like a really long time. These, these just aren't worth it. Because I think I've only played like 60 days of this Let's Play anyway already. So what I was, was going to do is I was going to make my way down to Blackfall and see if I could get away with raiding it. I don't think I will be able to. Well, there's some broken men right there. Some Stormlands broken men. That's actually quite good for us. Um, so yeah, let's go and head over here. I mean, I, I, yeah, I really don't think I'll get... Yeah, we're already getting chased. Is that Loras Tyrell chasing us as well? It is, so cool. Hopefully we can escape him in the darkness. Ah, run! Yeah, we are going to escape him, yeah. So that, that plan kind of didn't work. I didn't think it would work. Still under siege, cool. So I might just head back to the Crown Lands. Um, I was just going to see if I could get away with trying to do that, but Loras Tyrell was there getting ready to stop me. And we do also need to buy some food soon, actually. I mean, if we can fight these broken men, that'd be nice. But I'm on... Oh, no, I'm actually even faster than them. Cool. Um, when I'm done with you, you regret leaving the army. There's no need to fight. I'm ready to pay for my passage. I'll give you good money to... Uh, if you join my army. I mean, I don't really need men right now. So let's uh, take the field with my troops. Let's go ahead. Yeah, let's go and just do this. Um, I can command whilst I'm on the field. This is nice and open as well. Um, actually, is that a, that's a hill by the looks of it. So let's go ahead and try to get to the crest of this hill. It's a very woody map though, so I bet you half their men will actually just get stuck, which is going to be really annoying. Um, let's go ahead and just tell people to, well, everyone just to come up here. Like especially horsemen as well. That's just this is going to get really annoying. 
Oh no, it's actually pretty open if I come over here. Cool, so my, my infantry can go ahead and hold here in this nice little gap. Um, infantry hold position here. And then archers hold position here. And then cavalry hold position here. Cool. Oh, they're actually shooting me already. That's pretty rude. Let's go to the trees for cover. Do they not have like any infantry? Because my infantry is just getting nice and formed up. Um, but it looks like they're just going to shoot me. So I guess infantry charge. Um, I don't want to tell my cav to charge that quickly. Oh my god, it's my one horseman, isn't it? Yeah, so everyone, I guess everyone charge. Because I've got uh, one of my heroes is actually classed as infantry, even though he's on horseback. But hopefully the rest of my horsemen will be able to, if my freaking uh, archers move. Cool, the rest of the arch, the archers are moving so the rest of the cav can get through, nice. I've lost a pikeman to their missiles, so that's fine. My cav should be getting involved now and doing damage. I just need to go over there and try and protect the rest of my cav. Because these guys actually have spears. So these guys are really the only dangerous thing. Let's go ahead and go over and help this dude, if we can. If we can actually catch up to them. Oh, there's a two-handed swordsman there as well. Nice, you hit him pretty heavily. Oh, you bastard. That was for his life. At least I can get on his horse now. <laughs> I guess that wasn't the end of the world. Um, is there anyone actually over here really worth killing? Um, no, let's go to the, the bigger fight. We need to go ahead and help out our infantry, even though it looks like they're doing a good job on the left-hand side. But we might as well just go over and kill the rest of their horse, uh, the rest of their archers, because they're just backing off right now, and it's annoying. This horse is almost dead, though. Hopefully I've slowed them up enough so my men can kill them. I mean, they're pretty much all dead, are they not? Yeah, we've got one guy left. He's trying to run away. And he died. Nice. Um, again, I think we took, like, no casualties. So things are starting to go really good in this Let's Play since joining Stannis. Um, yeah, we lost. Six men were killed. Pikemen. Veteran swords. Oh, he keeps on dying. And my, my sir, uh, one of my dudes I actually captured, died as well. Or oh, one of my heroes died. That's to be expected, considering, um, yeah, considering he went full on into the enemy. So nothing really that great we got there, which is fine. I guess, cool, so I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here, um, because we've done quite a lot. We fought some battles, we actually took a, took a load of, um, a load of loot, which was good. And as well as that, if I can actually click on Dragonstone, if it's going to let me. As well as that, we got our own fifth, which is nice. So hopefully we can get a castle in future, that would be a lot nicer. Um, and we also need to go ahead and keep on trying to boost up our leadership. Because at the moment our leadership is not great. And I want to be able to have more men. So as soon as we get to around like 100 and something men. Like then we can start taking. Like thinking about starting our own kingdom. Because what we can do is we can take out the three sisters. And they're pretty much like I guess the, the staple of where you start your own kingdom. Um, yeah I can't really stop him though. If he is destroying my castle. And they're still besieging King's Landing. I really don't think they'll be able to do it. Because it has 800 men defending it. That's just crazy. I think Stan is alone and he has like 500, 600 with him. So I really don't see how he's going to do that. But yeah, so I'll go ahead and end the episode here. And I'll see you guys next time. Fish out.